Revelation 3805. From the 19th of June 1946. Spiritual Low Level. The End of a Salvation Period. No spiritual progress can ever be expected if humanity's spiritual level is so low that it no longer recognizes and acknowledges God. For then it is completely separate from God and thus also without the flow of strength which guarantees its spiritual progress. A short distance to God can easily be remedied, for then the soul will still move within the cycle of the divine flow of love the strength of which will infallibly impel it to progress. But if the distance has become so great that the spiritual essence is beyond this cycle then it will also be entirely without strength and no longer able to approach God, since the opposing force will then have greater influence and pull it down to itself. But once humanity has reached this degree of development, that is, once it has regressed to this extent, it will also have forfeited its right to exist on earth as human beings, as this is solely for the purpose of higher development and it will have totally disregarded this purpose. Thus the developmental period for this human race will then come to an end. The earth will effectively repel all spiritual essence in the stage of higher development as soon as it no longer lives and acts in line with this stage of development. And this is the end of a period of redemption in accordance with divine will. And every person can know the moment in time himself as long as he pays attention to the whole of humanity's spiritual development. Once the lowest spiritual point has been reached when the heartlessness becomes plainly evident, the activity of the opposing force can be recognized by the fact that instead of constant progress there will be destruction everywhere. Once people's lives and activities are totally in opposition to God and thus against all divine order, it is no longer to be expected that humanity will voluntarily integrate with divine order again and then, according to eternal law, a disintegration of everything sheltering spiritual substances will have to take place for the purpose of a completely new banishment so that after an infinitely long time the goal to live voluntarily in the proximity of God can be reached yet again. There is no other opportunity of ascent for a degenerated human race once it has reached the lowest point when all love has grown cold, since then the strengthening flow of divine love can no longer be effective and this signifies a total obedience to God's opponent. Yet God, in his great mercy, will seize from his adversary what has become enslaved by him by banishing it into the creations again, which are outside the adversary's influence. Hence, even the return into hardest matter is but a work of divine mercy, since it creates a new opportunity for those spiritual substances furthest away from God to take the path of higher development again, which was no longer possible as a human being. And one day the hour of salvation will come to him too, if only after an endless time. Yet he will not be treated unjustly by being returned into solid matter, for his will is so hardened towards God that he provides the reason himself for being bound by God for an infinitely long time. For he will not change any more once the spiritual low level has been reached when people no longer recognize God. Amen.